Hey guys, I'm at the Domus Romana in the city of Amdina in Malta. And Domus Romana just means Roman house. And this was in fact the house of a Roman uh, during the Roman Empire. And they have a beautiful collection of Roman floor mosaics, so check some of them out. And the big one. Pretty nice. I'm here in the Victoria Citadel on the island of Gozo and this island has an extremely long and interesting history. People have been living here for thousands of years and a lot of the economy of the island has always been based on simple agriculture. But some of its more interesting history also involves its history as a prison. Of course many small islands have that sort of dubious distinction. Some of the very famous prisoners to live here include a man named Jean Valletta, who would later become a great hero of Malta after he was released from prison. And today, the capital city of the whole country is named Valletta in his honor. Another very famous prisoner on this island was the son of Byzantine Emperor Heraclius. We might remember Heraclius as the Byzantine Emperor who defeated Sassanid Persia in one of the last great wars the Sassanids fought, but he also was a little unpopular at home, including with his own son. Heraclius learned his son was planning to overthrow him, and as punishment, he had one of his son's eyes poked out and both of his hands cut off. The son was then put on a boat to this island, and when he arrived, the governor of the island cut off one of his feet. Not very fun. Suffice it to say, the son didn't live very long here, not having hands or very many feet. Uh, most of Gozo's history is not so brutal, though. And as you can see, it's a very beautiful island to visit. 